Hap Yarvo. Hello. Um, it's pretty simple, guys. Today I'm reacting to Lee Matthews and his best career moments. Why? Because I searched Google best AFL player of all time and it said Lee Matthews. So I feel like I need to know who he is. If he's the best AFL footy player of all time, I'd better know who he is. Or at least watch three and a half minutes of his best plays ever. They got to be pretty good if he's the best ever and these are his best plays ever. Right. One, two, three, four. It looks just like an American football. Like this cartoon of it. If I didn't know any better. I guess it's a little more rounded on the end. Like a rugby ball. Uh, Biffin, a chance here, but Biffin taps the ball away. Got a chance for Hawthorne as Matthews is there. Matthews with the ball for Hawthorne, getting out of trouble. Picks up. He's number three, ball. I assume. A good shot, I think. This is so funny somehow. <laughs> Watching this old timey AFL. This guy in like a pea coat? How isn't it a thousand degrees? What are you doing in a pea coat and a hat? I guess it's a chilly day. Everybody's got a coat on. But just the announcer, I didn't know old-timey Australians sounded that way, too, like how they did in America. This is awesome. A good goal by Lee Matthews. Good piece of football. Like, that's an old-timey Australian accent. Matthews. Oh, what a grab from the skipper. He was about 33 years of age. I don't know how he got up that high. <laughs> I take offense to that. I'm not 33 yet, but I take offense. Good kick from Wallace, looking for Matthews. Heard, oh, beautiful one hand. They're just not uh, completing it enough. Why did he only have to Good use one hand Wallace, here? For it's just because they are tangled up. Heard, oh, beautiful one hand. They're just not uh, completing it enough. Matthews, a shot at goal. Dang. Just a feel as though they're not out there, don't they? Looks that way at the moment. This, this is a perfect example. Kink was 30 So he's 34 away, now. No attempt to get to the kick. So he's, is he a Tasmania player? Five goals to Matthews and a chance to make it number six. The medallion and the Premiership Cup for 1983 for the captain. I knew it was the 80s, just looking at that stash. I knew it. It's amazing how you can tell, even all the way on the other side of the world, I could tell it was the 1980s because of those shorts and the stash. Three. Damn! Oh, this one launched the that. that broke the point, oh, talk about a he -man. How, was that? He How do you do that? Down. It already looked short. Why is it already oh. short? Oh, that's the shorter outside pole. And they're. How... What are they doing? How did it A fantastic effort by Lee Matthews. Okay. Chance for Hawthorne to score now. They've got the loose man going. How did he pop that out like that? I just had to watch this again. Guys, what in the heck? It's like it launched out. What did he? Oh, he he hits it with the other hand. They've got the loose man going into the forward pocket. Here's Matthews. Doesn't miss many, and in fact hasn't missed that one either. Setting himself in front. Gordon knocked on Don Scott. Can he get a boot to it? Oh, because that makes it go. That's more points, right? Than if it just rolled in. Deep out on the half forward flank, a lead and a good one in front. Matthews, Fowler arriving late. He bounds up straight away, lines Boom. up from straight down the middle. These guys would be amazing kickers in the NFL. Scott's looking for Matthews out on that half forward flank. Matthews is there and a mark. Lee Matthews already kicked. That was a mark, goals. huh? He's about 50 meters out though, going for the torpedo. I always think a mark is where you have to climb on their shoulders. Through goal, lead. Looking there for Matthews. Matthews in the front position. Oh, terrible Ooh. mark by Matthews. He's terrible mark. Big smile. He's it's crazy how they play this with no pads. Saying, what about a 15 meter penalty? Have a look at that. His blood streaming down his face. Ooh. I, I didn't see the blood. Market, Will he be the highest paid in the business? Look at that. No doubt about it. Well done. Ball. It's a goal. <laughs> I love this dude. Reminds me of something from cricket. Matthews. The guys with the hats and cricket. 
except they. Okay, this is number one. Now we're back to way in back in the day. 1971 Grand Final. Whoa. What happened? <laughs> so it was a mark. So he's got a kick here, I think. 65 yards. 65 yards to goal. He launches it. Straight down the middle, as always. And there's the peacock, guys. Let's go. <laughs> Legend. None of these old clips came close to capturing the breadth of Matthew's talent. Damn. Well, maybe I should have read that first. <laughs> I enjoyed it. I guess I'll just have to watch more. When you've been in the game so long, you've got black and white highlights. No freaking kidding. He has to be the greatest of all time. His stats are insane, and he had great skills. Toughness as well. The complete player. Is it one of those things, though? I mean, I've got to ask. No offense to him. Of course. He's a legend, no matter what. But do you think he's as good as the guys are today? Because a lot of things, like whether it's tennis, pretty much any sport, people get better over time somehow. I don't know how. But typically, you know, you look back at the greatest of all time in any given sport, you might say, um, you know, I don't know. Roger Federer, he's the greatest of all time, in my opinion, tennis. But Djokovic is probably better. <laughs> But they kind of, they're not really that far apart. So it's kind of a bad example. I don't know, but you know what I mean. Is he still the greatest? Or the greatest of his time? And I guess you've got to choose someone as the greatest of all time. You know, of course, in the future, people are probably going to keep getting better. But if someone's going to be the greatest of all time, maybe it shouldn't matter whether it was back in their day or not. Anyway, that's all I'm thinking, guys. That was fun. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys are doing good. I hope to see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.